you got a spot, no one can take it. Y'all just gonna have to deal with the windows rolled down because I'm frolicking in these streets today. You feel me? Whatever noise that comes with it. I actually wanted to talk to y'all real quick. I mean, you could have been went, Chad. I don't know if this dude named Chad, but he was like, he got a good credit score, motherfucker. Anyway. <laughs> I'm soft. I'm, you know. You, you can't keep your girl down for too long. You know what I mean? And it's been real humid and hot outside. And I appreciate it. Let me move. We in frame. Cool, cool, cool. Anyway. Um. I wanted to start off the vlog. Apparently loud and violent. <laughs> anyway. I wanted to come on here and talk about more recently when I see travel content all I see is crowded ass places now first off I'm not going nowhere where it's crowded as you've seen I have been in very serene places barely anybody be going that's low key because I be on vacation why are we going to vacation sites where there's 15 million people? That don't make no sense to me. And then already being stressed out getting to the destination. You're being, you're doing all of this stuff on vacation. So you'd be tired by the time you get back to where you feel like you got to, you know, have a vacation. And then you gotta worry about having uh, excursions booked and all that. Worrying about the certain time frames. Worrying about if you can even book something. The clubs be booked. The whatever. Snorkeling. ATV. I don't get how that got so popular. Why? Why? First off, why is that popular? Why is ATV and snorkeling swimming with the dolphins? Like, why is that? I don't get the appeal. I'm gonna sit my ass down, get some good food, chill out, vibe out with the people. You know? Is that just me? It can't be just me. About to give me a grilled cheese. Hey, thanks for shopping. How are you today? Good. How are you? Doing well. Thanks. What can we get started for ya? Uh, do you guys have the grilled cheeses available? Let me double check. Give me one second. Sure. Anybody get me a fancy hot pocket? Alright, I was able to track one of those down for you. Wonderful. Can I get that double toasted by chance? Yeah, for sure. Wonderful. And then I'll take one of the spinach, feta, and egg wraps too. Okay. And that's it. You got it. Come on down. Thank you. I haven't been to Starbucks in, I think, <clears throat> has it already been a year? These prices, you ain't got no meal, fam. You ain't got no soup, to, you know what I'm saying? Be a Panera or something, you know? Our bags. <laughs> anyway, the whole concept of me talking about having these people go to places where they got bumper clot people, ample people. I don't. I don't understand. This is all stemming from me not booking a trip for real, and I'm supposed to leave in two days. Now mind you, this is more of a leisure trip. I mean, usually they all are. I'm just saying, me personally, I I do not like booking stuff 48 hours before. It at least needs to be a week. I don't like packing day of. Y'all got me messed up with that. I don't like trying to maneuver with other people because just people are stupid when it comes to traveling. I don't do girls trips. Sorry. Because... 
I'm not bucking up with nobody. I'm too old for that. Been there, done that. I'm not shacking up. No. Y'all trying to be economically sound when it comes to these travel ventures. But at this point, some of it just be ratchet as hell. And I don't understand. Call me what you want. I don't care. Anyway. Grab my grilled cheese in my fancy hot pocket. About to grow. Because the only reason why I got that was because I got some tomato bisque in the fridge. And I don't feel like eating it by itself. So the grilled cheese real good because you heard the order you know about to throw around so again we gonna see where this <laughs> vlog ends up I may be at the beach maybe by the water maybe by the <laughs> taking your nigga <laughs> This has been my reality for the last several days. Just kicking back, watching TV, shows, movies, and just not doing anything. And I've been really like, like being overly unstimulated on purpose. And I love that for me. I did wanna try and go to the you know the matinee deals at night you know because they run them all day where i'm at tuesday you get matinee prices all day and you should look up your own feeder because pretty much matinee prices are could be 50 to 60 percent off which is cool so i just <laughs> i'm not gonna be paying a full ticket ever since i found that out for what you know what i mean so I may go to the movies tomorrow and watch the new Deadpool Wolverine movie because why not? The Deadpool franchise I enjoy the most because I am a Marvel person that just his mannerisms and of course I've always been a Ryan Reynolds fan anyway just along his career with his acting profile so when this came out I was like wow that's really cool you know so and then I'm glad they actually came out with another installment hmm <laughs> yeah that may be the plan just have a movie date night for myself because I haven't done anything like I literally have not left the house all last week pretty much just came home worked out did my thing I'm just chilled like so the last clip was like several days ago which is abnormal to me but at the same time I just was like I don't want to work myself into a depression with this like I said y'all gonna get the real like <laughs> just I'm, good. I'm gonna keep my thoughts to myself with that but it was a recharging moment for me and now I'm back. So life may be a little bit boring for a little bit. I'm not too sure. Just because I haven't booked a trip like I initially planned to. And I'd rather just have the money for things that I want. Which is basically just clothes and objects. Meaning, a couple more proje projects. No, a couple more products <laughs> that I'm getting finally got some eye patches y'all and y'all know that i have been wanting just stuff for this now mind you the gummies that i've been using has been helping my under eye but given that 
the eczema that I had dug in so deep in my under eye it's like a permanent socket and then I'll do a review once I get it and I need a change with my hair I am gonna get some products to actually do some braids but I also bought some temporary dye you know the basic um, I am as I am thing I heard different mixed reviews with that but at the same time as long as you dry your hair or if it's dry and you apply it and redry because it is a water-based product so it should be fine I bought those one of those hair dryer extension things where you put the cap on and then it heats up so I just need something new for the end of summer beginning of fall and then if I do like the product I hope to buy the burgundy one for the winter so fingers crossed for that because I need something new color wise with my hair so if you see a change up with that just know it's what it is the curls are going to be colored temporarily because why not the product was made for that purpose for those that don't want to dye their hair you know permanently and i've never seen myself doing that but i do desperately <laughs> need a change so tired of the status quo and hopefully exploring just new styles because my curls have you know they're i love my curls it's just i want to be more versatile with my hair and more easier styles and the only way that I know how is the protective style of either twist or braids unfortunately because I just don't see the point for me to put on units I get I get it I get it for other other people but I don't know I guess I'm not patient enough to put on my own wig because all the plucking and the sealing and the this and the th I really don't have time. Could I do a headband wig? Sure. Do I want to? No. <laughs> just putting that out there. So I'm gonna, you know, just try what I feel is in my comfort zone now and then explore from there because your girl needs a little change up, needs some brightening, needs some something. The next clip is either gonna be me at the movies, at a store, hopefully something productive but if it's just like this again and it's a very boring i'm just chatting with y'all then just like it anyway comment anyway <laughs> i appreciate it and good night for now as y'all can see Something more even.